Hey everybody, it's Jeremy. Welcome back to Baldur's Gate, Siege of Dragonspear. This is episode 24, yep. I believe, and we are in a troll cave? Here we go. Troll cave! Small trolls. So, as per normal, we're gonna we're gonna try to see. Yes. So Bane, Bane is a god, absolutely. But Bane is not a devil, and and this story is not about Bane. This story is about Fall. A wizard's might. Although I mean, I don't know. Maybe Bane shows up in this story. I, I'm I don't know. But where, so your character, the main no character in Baldur's Gate, is a ball spawn, is a child of ball. So I have no idea. Ooh. This group shows promise. Extraordinary. You're that supposed to be shooting. She's supposed to be shooting fire arrows so that they're not reviving. Yeah, Bane, Bane, Ball, and Merkel were the dead three. Yeah. So, like I said, uh, it's it's entirely possible Bane does fit into the story somewhere, but not that I'm aware of. We got a skull and a winter wolf pelt. This pure white pelt of the winter wolf is soft and luxurious. It is often sewn into garments as diverse as the rugged this vests of the northern Uthgard promise. barbarians and the delicate and fashionable winter stoles worn by noble women throughout the Sword Coast region. Interesting. It feels like uh, in that type of scenario, probably Magic worthwhile to well in a tired mind. hold on to that. Oh, I must sleep. This was an interesting little, like, diversion. No real reason, like... This... If random encounters were like this in the base game, it'd be super fucking cool. But random encounters are normally, like, generic map, you get attacked by generic people, done and done. Oh, you bet. Oh, wow, we're actually... The camp is still here. Cool. Well, if that's the case, let's go ahead and talk to Thade, and let's rest. Right. Okay. And now, we will head up to... Tacos, and uh, turn in that quest. The Halfling Treasures quest. Your orders? Still have plus one arrows. I have a crazy amount of plus one arrows. Okay. There we go. All right, hopefully we don't have to like actually pull out all the items. Oh, it's you again. Mm. I found the items you wanted. Still closed. I don't believe it. I thought for sure the bandits would murder you in the forest. <laughs> uh, I'm the one who does the murdering. You truly are a hero, ma'am. Here, please take this dart as a token of my gratitude. I considered using it to kill myself, but I have a reason to go on now. Thank you. Thanks to you. I returned priceless heirlooms to you, and a dart is all I get for my efforts. No, that's the, we are we are not pushy. Um, besides, honestly, none of those items are super interesting to me. The mirror was interesting, but I can't figure out how to use the damn thing. So fuck it. I, I'm just gonna say thank you. Um, so we lost the mirror, the cloak of the Balier watch, and the small shield, the sun catcher shield. Now I have to get going. If I'm lucky, I can catch my wife before she gets too far. Hopefully she'll take me back.
Good luck, tacos. I'm coming, my love. Good luck. Good luck, buddy. Good luck. What's this dart? Dart. Up. The biter plus two. Cool. Is it like a permanent dart? Because that would actually be nice to give to, to Dinahair. This dart gleams like a streak of light when flying through the air. When it hits its target, it releases a tiny acid droplet before soaring back to the hand that threw it. Nice. Sometimes the acid manages to burn a hole in the target's armor. 10% chance per hit of penalizing the target's armor class by one for one turn. Returns to the hand wielder's hand when thrown. Fuck yeah. I am not a servant to carry so much. You are. It. Ugh. Okay, well, if that's the case, we're just going to give all of these darts over to Orwen. You can put them in the ammo bag. And we go from there. Put that on. Why not? Gorditas. What's the story? Good luck, yeah. Chalupa. Gord oh, man. Now I'm hungry. Shit. I was thinking of, uh, I, I've got some hummus in the fridge. I was thinking of that earlier. So maybe after this video, I take a snack break. You know how it'd be. All right, we've got 72,000 to level on Latia, 21,000 on Glint, 144, 83, 94, 120. Just threw pizza rolls in the oven. Mmm. Huh? Tasty, tasty. Right. Okay. I think we should be pretty good to go ahead and venture forth into the troll claws now. With the coastway crossing destroyed. The only safe route across the winding water is Boriskir Bridge, where your father, Baal, was murdered by the mad god Siric. Each step toward the distant landmark fills you with unease. You are not alone in that. The Flaming Fists also fear what may lie ahead. If Kalar has destroyed Boriskir Bridge, the expedition will not reach Dragonspear Castle in time to stop the crusade. The forces of Baldur's Gate and its allies will be outmatched, slaughtered. These fears grip your allies, but also drive them forward. The anxious whispers fall silent when the march is called to a halt less than a day's travel from Borskir. The Flaming Fist sets up camp and prepares for the next meeting with the Crusade, while you plan your next move. Interesting. Interesting. I like it. Let's do it. I am sorry for your loss, but rest assured that your husband's sacrifice will never be forgotten. Signed, yours ever in faith, Kalar Argent. I am sure the family will find your words most comforting, milady. More letters of condolence, my lady? Surely there are other, more urgent matters that require your attention? I am not of a mind to argue this again, Heffernan. Their deaths lay heavy on us all, my lady. But they sacrifice themselves for a greater good. Letting their passing distract us would do them a disservice. Condolences can wait. You are correct. We cannot afford distractions at this juncture. Actually, have a mind to agree with Heffernan on that. We have much to do. If you're conducting a military operation, take note of the dead, absolutely. But condolences can wait until after the. <sighs> right. Or at the least on the road hand is that Ooh. Kalar's followers have taken Boriskir Bridge and surrounded Bridgeport. We'll not cross the winding water until they're dealt with. The watches have been set and scouts deployed, Corporal. The last thing we need is a band of trolls catching us unawares. Trolls we can handle. It's the crusade that worries me. We should make contact with those in Bridgeport. If there are any left.
I'll scout to the north. Perhaps I can find a way to reach the fort's defenders. Be prudent in your ranging. One of our scouts stumbled onto a troll cave to the northwest. She barely made it back alive. Okay, so let's go to the northwest. Gotcha. Might do well to grab some fire arrows from Belagarn before you move too far from the camp. We are pretty good on the fire arrows, but we're doing okay. Okay, so... Check foxes. Sure, why not? Ah. Ski? What do you want now, Bence? It's Corporal Duncan Fist. Why aren't you doing drills with the rest of your squad? Got better things to do. Hmm, Ski. You joined the Flaming Fist willingly, Ski. You chose subservience. Drills are a consequence of that choice. What would you have me do? March back and forth in the muck with the other Adelpates? If that is your commanding officer's order, then yes. You need to do this, Ski. If you don't, Intar will never see you as anything but a child. That is low. You, what? What do you mean that's low? You, all of this is about this. Show me where the Adelpates are again, Vince. Guess I've got some mud to march around in. And my thanks, Lutia. Come on, gold buckler. Gold buckler? Is that what they call her? Let's get you back to the drills. Hmm? Yep. Well, oh, Bayloth's actually here. Interesting. Let's uh let's talk to Belagram right. real quick and sell off some of I the... have many fine wares. You have many fine wares. Uh we'll sell off some of the crap. Uh we'll keep the bullets. We'll sell the darts. Un, un, un. Nice money. Sell. Oh. Swank. Yep. All right, who's this Lieutenant Otilda? Order is what matters. Latia, what did you see out there? You seem nervous, Lieutenant. Is everything all right? Sorry to bother you, ma'am. Might I have a word? What is it? It's those half-orcs that showed up last night saying they wanted to bash Crusaders. The Irregulars, we've been calling them. No one seemed to think their joining us was a bad idea, but I don't trust them. They say they would fight the Crusade. Why wouldn't you trust them? Well, they're half-orcs. Vicious, uncivilized beasts. Oof. Oof. The real problem is we know nothing about them. They could be spies, criminals, anything. If you picked a fight with them, they'd surely be sent on their way. No one would believe they didn't start it. These irregulars have done nothing wrong. I'll not pick a fight with any who, who might help us against Kalar, regardless of their race. That's what, if that's the way you see it. But it's on your head if they betray us. Well, watch them. Like, make sure they're kept under supervision like any mercenary band should be. And then go from there. Jeez, we're not saying, like, trust them implicitly. Ooh, this is a big-ass fucking base, man. Holy shit. Alright, we know... We know we've got trolls to the northwest. Is that what we said? Okay, Smells let's... like troll. Dumb and dangerous. And more dumb. What's the story? They called... Whatever thy wills. Oh no. Oops. Uh -huh. Alright, sorry, McKinn. Yep. Right to the northwest we go. Yeah. 
Tell me, Captain Corwin. Right. What is thine opinion of our friend, the hero of Baldur's Gate? Hadn't given it much thought. Having a famous hero around is handy, but it also seems to attract trouble. Or create it. Hey! Such people hey. always invite hassles. You don't get called hero without someone trying to pull you down. Oh my god, my Yet problem! Thou wouldst support our group and keep our companions standing in the face of those who wish us ill. That's my assignment, so yeah. Why do you ask? I just wanted to know where thou stood should worse come to worst, and now I do. All right, Dinah here. That sounded pretty suspicious. Oh! Oh, fuck me. This is gonna suck. A wizard's might. Didn't see that coming, did you? I'll recover. Oh, oh. Another try, I shall be. Kiss. <laughs> oh my goodness. Corwin is way worse when she is not shooting. She's so bad when she's not shooting. Can, do we have prefer? We do. We have prefer ranged on. Okay. Need me? Well. <laughs> Oh, you bet. We gotta wait for them to wake mm -hmm. up. Yep. Oh. Wake up! Yep. Wake up! Right. All right. We have oh, awoken. Bet. We continue northward. Ho! 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 Time to go? Flint. You bet. Really need you to check those faster. Man. Yep. Whoop. Whoop. Whopping over to the flames. That was just for practice. A wizard's might swing and a miss. That was just for practice. I need healing. Another to try, fight I shall be. I need healing. Whoop. To fight, let's talk more. Fight! Ouch! Oh. Oh, you bet. Oh. A wizard's might! I understand. No. Keep shooting. Yep. Time to end you. Jeez. Man, trolls are, uh... Yep. Trolls in this game are very different from the way I imagine trolls in most scenarios. So that was kind of like the road. So let's actually... Actually, head back down. And hit up there real quick. Because that was pretty rough. Those two fights. I need a swig of some strong dwarven ale. Uh oh. Books for bones, words for blood, candle keep. 
our home. It wasn't your fault we had to leave. <laughs> Only it was, wasn't it? All right, we got some weird head shit going on. You were all I had left in the world, and you abandoned me. Oh my god. I've got nothing left now. Nothing. Bullshit. Emowyn would never act like that. Absolutely not. I'm tired. I'm so tired. Please. I don't understand. I need you to do it. For me. Do as she asks. After everything you have done, everything you have put her through, you owe her this. No, it won't happen. Her end may not come at your hand, but it will come. It cannot be denied. All our ends will come. They cannot be denied. It, that's irrelevant. How do you feel? I feel like you're a shitbag. And I really want to kick you in the face. God help me. Uh -huh. Minsk, I just had a thought. Right. What if, what if I'm not a gnome? What if I'm actually a miniature giant space gnome from space? Bo says that's crazy. You are a crazy in the head gnome. A crazy in the head gnome from space. These two cannot be allowed to be together. It's think not. It's I know. It's not it's amazing. acceptable. Amazing. My absolute favorite thing about you, other than Boo, of course. Got to love the hamster. You may be crazy in the head, but Boo says you have taste. Yep. Boo is correct. You have taste. Pretty yep. nice. All right. <laughs> Onwards we go. Hello, Moose. Ah. The Troll Cave. Holy shit, that's a lot of trolls. We are immediately starting with a haste. We are immediately putting on fire arrows. Another try I shall give. Ow! 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 Ooh. No way. Yeah, no, this is too much. We will need to buff severely, I'm assuming. Need healing. I go. I'll recover. I won't forget. Didn't see that coming, did you? All right, we are going to buff up the Only jam. That. Yeah, I, I, I know. I'm bad. Uh -huh. Leave me alone. Okay. Uh, we're going to blur. We are going to blur. We want a shield. i blur. Going to... That one. Going to... 
It's only six rounds, so we'll do that right before we go in. Oh, wait, she already did that. A bless. It's chanted. He's going to armor of faith himself. Oh, he didn't chant. He did whatchamacallit. Need me? Yeah? Okay, we're good there, and we're going to drop a haste. Alright, let's give that a quick save and see how we do now. Oh, you bet. I'll recover. Need. I go Fuck. to the ghosts. No. <sighs> I mean, you know, sure, but that's the difference between a tabletop game and a uh, role or a fucking yep. regular RPG. Another try, I shall yes. give. I need to try to take down some of these bigger ones first. Um, hmm. Didn't see that coming, did you? Okay, come on. Get some of these down. We're close. I've traveled with a lot of great people in the past. I'll recover. I'll recover. Ow! Didn't see that coming, did you? Ha! My aim is true. Ow! Yes, group shows promise. Extraordinary. Ooh. Jeez. That was fucking sketchy scary. Hell yeah, we're yep. fatigued after all that. You kidding me? That was a spirit troll, boys. 
Bear. Well, Mommy no, it wasn't. Forever. It was a troll shaman. Got to rest. My eyelids are as heavy as lead, or steel, or gold. Oh, let's say gold. Oh, if I don't lie I'm down, tired. I'll fall asleep on my feet. Ten water star gems is pretty pricey. Magic does not nest well in a tired mind. Ah, I'm a tinder sleep. box. Oh, we've done so much today. Maybe it's time for a quick nap. Interesting. Oh, you bet. Oh, that is a spectral troll, though. Yep. A I wizard, I shall. Oh, here, get out of there. Fight on. <laughs> Probably gonna lose this, actually. Uh, yep, Dinahair, just uh, keep blasting, please. Oh, you're out. Oh, no. Well, maybe use some stuff. I best talk more fight. I called. Let's talk more fight. Yeah. Yes. I guess. Another try, I shall give. No. Doesn't it evil? Doesn't it evil? That stings, doesn't it evil? Oh my god, that was scary. That was one of those scenarios where you're like, you, uh, like in, in, in a tabletop, right? You're like, oh, we just beat the big, the big scenario. Let's explore around the room and loot everything. And then you're like, oh god, there's something else in here. <laughs> oh, fuck. I found a secret room and I was like, cool, treasure. I wasn't like, cool, guy. Darkseer. Yep. What? An army can't march forever. Yep. We've got to rest. Keep watch for ancient tomes or any or scrolls or that might contain oh, lost arcana. What I mean is, I'm tired. Yes. The light from the torch reveals a half-eaten corpse in an old, rusty chest nearby. Magic does Medium not nest well in ammo. a tired mind. Ah, I must sleep. Enchanted oh, weapon. Oh, we've done so much today. Oh, Maybe wow. it's time for a quick nap. Cool. Beljuril. Interesting. Very cool. Medium shield. Amulet. Locket of Embracing. Esthia and Ambrose both served as Knights of the Mystic Fire, paladins dedicated to Mistra, goddess of magic. Esthia had this necklace commissioned for Ambrose, telling him it would ensure his safety when she could not hold him in her arms. On his last mission, Ambrose sent the necklace back to Esthia with a note telling her he had met another woman who would never return to the chapter house. Heartbroken, Esthia threw the necklace into a ditch where it was later found by a peddler. 
wow. That's so sad. Caster level plus one for clerics and paladins can memorize two extra first level divine spells. Sweet. We will put that on Glint. Absolutely. On to fear. Snag that on. Blah, 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 blah. Very good. Cool. What will we put on his extra spells? Probably just Cure Light Wounds, honestly. Uh, protection from evil, we have, uh, whatchamacallit now? Remove Fear would probably be good. So we'll do like one Remove Fear and then Cure Light Wounds. Command is good, but whatever. Oh, you bet. All right, that was very cool. Very cool little troll cave for us to fight in. Um, we're pretty banged up, uh, but I'm sure we can just make it back to camp and be, uh, be none the worse. We will do that next time on Baldur's Gate, Siege of Dragonspear. See you then. Bye, everybody.